Narcissists are often challenging to deal with because they think they are the best at everything, and they can't stand to be wrong or challenged in any way. The key is to figure out what makes them tick and then do the opposite of everything they do. Some would take it slowly and with a lot of patience. So how do you get them back down? How do you destroy a narcissist? Make sure you watch until the end as I show you 10 tips to destroy narcissists before they destroy you. Number 1. You just have to be yourself. The simplest way of destroying a narcissist is to be yourself. Narcissists love fake people, so they will hate you if you're not affected. If they ask you how you're doing, just tell them how you're doing. And if they don't like it, they can unfollow or unfriend or whatever because that's what narcissists do when things aren't going their way. When a narcissist tries to take over your life and tell you what to do and how things should be done, just ignore them. Don't listen to them when they try to lecture you on how you live your life or tell you what's wrong with yours. Don't let them convince you that their way is better than yours. Because if there's one thing narcissists aren't good at, it's listening. Even if they weren't listening, they wouldn't understand anything anyway. Narcissists are self-centered individuals who are very good at making themselves look like they're the ones who matter in any given situation. Number 2. Learn to say no. One of the best ways to destroy a narcissist is to learn how to say no. If you are constantly saying yes and giving in to the narcissist's demands, you will never be able to live your life the way you want. You need to learn how to say no when it matters most. No, you can't have my money. No, I don't want to do that. No, we don't need to talk about this again. You might think it takes a lot of courage to stand up to someone who thinks they can get whatever they want, whenever they want it. You don't have to give a reason or an explanation. Just say it firmly and with conviction. Speaking no will provide you with infinitely more confidence than letting someone else walk all over you ever could. Number 3. Don't give them the attention and approval they need. Narcissists are like vampires. They need to feed on your energy and attention. They can't help themselves. It's just a part of their nature. They will always want more from you. Narcissists need constant validation, and they won't stop until they get it. Narcissists love attention and praise, so don't give it to them. Don't let them be the center of attention at any party, gathering, or event. Show them that you have better things to do than talk to them. The less you pay attention to them, the less attention they get from everyone else around them. Eventually, even if you don't notice it happening right away, narcissists start fading into obscurity until they are gone completely. Number 4 point out that other people are better than them. One of the best ways to destroy a narcissist is to point out how much other people are better than them. Narcissists constantly compare themselves to others and feel good about themselves because they're better than everyone else. Suppose you point out that other people are better than them at something they care about. In that case, they feel like they're losing a competition, which will make them angry and defensive. This can be done in various ways. You could point out how smart someone else is compared to them. You could show them pictures of someone who has more money than they do, or talk about how attractive another person is compared to them. Whatever method you choose, keep doing it until your narcissist starts feeling bad about themselves and questioning whether they're as good as everyone else thinks they are. Number 5. Let them know of their flaws and weaknesses. Another way is to let them know of their flaws and weaknesses. You can do this by pointing out something less than optimistic about them, or telling them something about themselves that they may not know. Tell them they are not as good as they think they are. This can be done by making them feel inferior regularly, or by constantly pointing out their flaws. For example, you're not as smart as you think you are, or you're actually not as attractive as you think. If you do this long enough, they will start believing that there's nothing special about them. This will slowly chip away at their confidence until they're left with nothing but an empty shell of their former self. This will make them feel like they're not good enough for anyone else. This rejection may lead them to lash out at others because no one likes feeling rejected by someone else. Number 6. 
changed the subject of the topic when they talked about themselves. Narcissists are often very full of themselves. They love to talk about themselves and their achievements, but they're not as interested in hearing about others. Change the subject of the topic when they talk about themselves. When narcissists ask you a question or start talking about themselves, change it to something else that interests you. This will make them feel confused and then angry, which will make them realize how unimportant they are in your life. A narcissist will often try to control the conversation by talking about themselves. Still, if you don't engage with them, they'll eventually get bored and move on. Number 7. Don't let them manipulate you into feeling guilty. Narcissists are masters of manipulation, and guilt tripping is one of their favorite tools. The narcissist will use any opportunity to make you feel bad about yourself. And they'll do it in such a way that makes it seem like you are the one who is at fault. Don't let them manipulate you into feeling guilty. One way narcissists control people is by making them feel guilty about not fulfilling their needs or desires. This usually involves making false accusations. It may be tempting to give in, just so they stop accusing you. Know when your actions make them feel guilty and when they aren't. If you're doing something that makes them feel guilty, stop doing it. If not, keep going. Number 8. Be firm in your boundaries. Be firm about what you will or won't do for the narcissist, and make sure they know where your boundaries lie. This will help prevent them from exploiting your generosity or good nature for their own gain. If a narcissist is constantly asking for favors or using your kindness as leverage for their own gain, set clear boundaries that tell them what you won't do for them. This can be difficult if you feel like you owe them something because of their past behavior. Still. Setting boundaries will help prevent future manipulation from occurring. Number 9. Don't give them the power to control you. Narcissists often feel powerless in their lives and crave the feeling of control over others. Avoid giving them this sense of power by continuing to be honest and assertive, even if it means they get mad at you. Narcissists are all about control. They thrive on it, and they can't function without it. So if you want to destroy a narcissist, don't ever give them the power to control you. If you find yourself being controlled, take a step back and examine why that might be happening. Are you afraid of the narcissist? Do you feel like their needs are more important than yours? Are you trying to convince yourself that everything is fine so you don't have to face that this person is toxic? If so, know that this behavior will only feed into the narcissist's cycle of control and manipulation. Number 10. Be honest at all times. Narcissists are usually very confident and learn how to get what they want. Still, they can also be easily offended by others who don't agree with their opinions or don't see things from their perspective. The best way is, but it's also essential to know how to handle yourself in social situations. Narcissists are masters of manipulation, so it's essential to be as honest as possible. They will always try to manipulate you into saying things that make them look good, and they will always twist your words to make it seem like you agree with them. You need to be very careful about what you say and how you say it, because narcissists will use any information they can get from you against you. They're also susceptible to being attacked, so use caution when you disagree or point out their flaws. Narcissists can be very destructive to the people around them. You should now have a clearer picture of how to destroy narcissists through self-improvement, self-love, and kindness. Although it's impossible to eliminate narcissists entirely, we can overcome their negative influence and make our lives happier. Have you subscribed to this channel? Subscribe now and do not miss exciting videos. Like this video and watch this excellent video right over here. Video